the global arms race just hit a new level, and it's all about sixth-generation fighter jets. On December 26, 2024, China made a bold move by unveiling not one, but two advanced sixth-generation prototypes, shaking the foundation of U.S. air superiority. With this surprise reveal, China has demonstrated that it is no longer content to follow the U.S. lead. It wants to surpass it. But what exactly makes these next-generation aircraft so revolutionary, and where does the U.S. stand in this escalating competition? Let's dive into the technology, the major players, and the future of air combat. What defines a sixth-generation fighter? To grasp the significance of these new aircraft, it's important to understand what separates sixth-generation fighters from their fifth-generation predecessors like the USF-22 Raptor and China's J-20. While fifth-gen jets brought stealth, advanced sensors, and networked combat capabilities, sixth-generation fighters push the boundaries even further with these groundbreaking innovations. Advanced stealth, utilizing cutting-edge materials and designs to reduce radar and infrared signatures across multiple frequencies, making them even harder to detect. Artificial intelligence, AI. Integrated AI systems assist pilots with real-time decision-making and enable advanced manned-unmanned teaming. Manned-unmanned teaming, MUMT. Coordination with drone swarms for enhanced reconnaissance, electronic warfare, and combat operations. Hypersonic weapons. Capability to carry and launch hypersonic missiles for unmatched speed and extended strike ranges. Electronic warfare. Sophisticated systems to jam, hack, and disrupt enemy communications and radar systems. Networked combat acting as a central hub in a system of systems, sharing real-time data with other aircraft, satellites, and ground forces. In essence, sixth-generation fighters are not just about dominating the skies. They are designed to act as force multipliers, seamlessly integrating into a complex, data-driven battlefield. The U.S. has long been considered the leader in cutting-edge air combat technology and the Next Generation Air Dominance, NGAD program, is America's answer to future air warfare. First revealed in 2020, NGAD promised to revolutionize air combat with adaptive engines, modular payloads, and next-level sensing capabilities. However, progress has been slower than anticipated. The NGAD program faces significant hurdles, including budget constraints and political uncertainties. By mid-2024, the U.S. Air Force temporarily halted the program, citing cost overruns and the need for a comprehensive review. Each NGAD jet is estimated to cost between $250 million and $300 million, nearly three times the cost of an F-35. Air Force Secretary Frank Kendall highlighted that while the NGAD is vital for future air dominance, evolving technology and rising costs necessitate a complete reassessment. Despite these setbacks, the Pentagon recently awarded $3.5 billion in engine development contracts, signaling a renewed commitment to the program. However, analysts suggest that the NGAD might not reach operational capability until 2040, giving China a significant head start. Other major powers are also pursuing sixth-generation fighter technology. UK-Japan-Italy Global Combat Air Program, GSAP. A collaborative effort aiming to deploy a sixth-gen fighter by 2035. France-Germany-Spain Future Combat Air System, FCAS. This joint venture is still in the early design phases, with no immediate plans for test flights. Russia. Although still focused on upgrading its fifth-generation Su-57, Russia has hinted at sixth-gen capabilities, though progress remains slow due to economic and technological challenges. Why this race matters The sixth-generation fighter race is not just about technological bragging rights. 
It has profound implications for global security. These advanced jets will play a critical role in future conflicts, especially in contested regions like the Indo-Pacific and Eastern Europe. The ability to dominate airspace will determine who holds the upper hand in any potential conflict. China's rapid progress is a wake-up call for the U.S. and its allies. While the U.S. still maintains an edge in integrating advanced aircraft into broader military strategies, the gap is narrowing quickly. If China successfully fields a sixth-generation fighter by 2035, it could fundamentally alter the balance of power. The race for sixth-generation air dominance is also a high-stakes battle for defense industry giants like Lockheed Martin, Boeing, and Northrop Grumman. Lockheed Martin, with its extensive experience from the F-22 and F-35 programs, Lockheed is considered the front-runner to deliver the NGAD. Winning the contract could be worth up to $140 billion if 200 NGAD units are produced. Boeing, despite financial struggles and an unprofitable defense division, Boeing remains in the NGAD competition. Securing this contract could revive its fortunes and re-establish its position in advanced military aviation. Northrop Grumman Having dropped out of the NGAD race in 2023, Northrop is instead focused on delivering the B-21 Raider, a sixth-generation stealth bomber. The Raider successfully completed its first flight in November 2023, with multiple units currently undergoing testing. The unveiling of China's sixth-generation prototypes is a clear signal. The global air dominance race is accelerating, and the stakes have never been higher. While the U.S. maintains significant technological advantages, the pace of Chinese innovation cannot be ignored. The coming decade will determine who controls the skies. Will the U.S. overcome its budgetary and political challenges to deliver the NGAD on time? Or will China's aggressive development pace give it the edge in future air warfare? One thing is certain. The battle for sixth-generation air superiority is far from over, and the world is watching closely.